Samuels. Hold on, I missed it. Say again. Uh, my name is Alvin Samuels. I'm on the board of advisors of Lawrenceville Plasma Physics. And we have come from a meeting today with a group of the most prominent physicists in the world who have confirmed that we're on track to achieve what had previously been thought to be impossible. Pulse plasma fusion has the potential of creating a paradigm shift in the energy business and even in the future of humanity. These reactors are gonna be small, inexpensive, and transportable, and will enable the outlawing of uranium production, which is only ultimately usable for a bomb. It will greatly diminish the need for coal, uh, for fuel, it will transform the opportunities in the world today. It will be a paradigm shift in the entire energy business when it's successful. Imagine years from now, thousands of these plants located in every country of the world providing charged particles to feed the grid directly without the need for steam generation and at a cost approximately one-tenth that of coal with no pollution. A world free of pollution, not only from energy, but free from pollution of the mind by providing people with an opportunity to succeed, to grow, to love, without fear of the other, are threats from tyrants. It's a process that denies the tyranny of arrogance and promotes the audacity of hope by enabling truth to spread and a truth that enables every individual to achieve their optimum potential without fear from the other. And it does that by providing power to feed electrical motors, to drill water wells, to irrigate land, feed the hungry, and clothe the naked. No other process is so transportable and so singular in its purpose. And if it's successful, each of us who have invested will have done a most dramatic thing to change the way things are to the way things ought to be. I know of no other opportunity that any individuals have ever been given to have such a dramatic input into our future and the future of our children in a world free of pollution, free of oppression, and the opportunity to live lives of enduring worth. I strongly encourage you to consider being a part of this great effort to bring America back to its value as a democratic capitalistic society dedicated to the idea that every individual should be able to achieve their optimum potential. When we are free of the constraints from conventional energy sources, we will be free to expand our minds, our bodies, in the service of our country and our fellow man. I urge you to consider this as an investment in your future and mine and our children.